Everyone, welcome back. Today, we're entering the intriguing realm of AI voice cloning and the captivating world of synthetic voices. So buckle up as we explore the cutting edge technology that's changing the way that we experience sound. Let's get started. First things first, what exactly is AI voice cloning? It's not just about mimicking voices. It's a technological marvel. Imagine a world where artificial intelligence can replicate human voices seamlessly. But how does it work? Let's break down the technology behind it. AI voice cloning uses advanced algorithms to analyze and mimic the nuances of human speech. These synthetic voices find applications in various fields, from audiobooks to voice assistants. It's like having a virtual narrator at your fingertips. And can you imagine the amount of possibilities you could have with this. But with great power comes great responsibility. We can't ignore the ethical considerations and challenges linked to replicating public figures' voices. Now let's talk about the impact of AI voice cloning on the entertainment industry. From dubbing in films to creating personalized experiences, it's revolutionizing the way that we consume content. And guess what? Celebrities are getting in on the action too. We're witnessing a rising trend of celebrity voice generators in social media and content creation. Can you imagine your favorite stars lending their voices for unique and personalized interactions it's a game changer. And we can also use that here with Lovo AI with Jenny. But when addressing the ethical concerns surrounding AI voice cloning, from potential misuse to evolving legal regulations, there's a lot to consider. But on the flip side, how does AI voice cloning enhance user experiences through personalized interactions? Well, it's a delicate balance and we need to navigate the future with caution. What are your thoughts on the ethical implications? As we wrap up our journey into the realm of AI voice cloning, one question lingers. What does the future hold? Can this technology help us explore and express our creativity in ways that we've never imagined? Perhaps AI is just simply a tool, an instrument that enables us to reach new heights. Text-to-speech technology can be used for a lot of fun things, like imitating your favorite celebrities, but you can also use it for business and marketing purposes. This is particularly good news for businesses with limited budgets as voiceover artists don't come cheap. Instead, you can use AI voice generators to create lifelike voiceovers suitable for videos and podcasts. Here at Lovo AI, our text-to-speech voiceover, Jenny, provides over 600 plus different voices in 100 plus different languages and expresses more than 25 different emotions. Let me quickly show you how. First things first, when you sign into Lovo AI, you can get brought to Jenny and then from there you can create a new advanced untitled project. And from here you can go over to voice cloning and you can actually clone your own voice. Doing this, all you have to do is create a voice clone. And then from here, you would just simply record your own audio. And you can do that with your own mic through your own computer or via your phone as well. And then from there, you can create your own voice and just have it set as well. Now here with Jenny, there are so many voices you can choose from. You can go over to Pro Voice, and then from here, you can select from any of the hundreds and hundreds of voices as well. And with all of these, you can see their accents that they have. And then from there, you can input specific texts and then have those voices read out those texts like magic. I mean, it works so well. So it's super easy to use. And I've also made a tutorial on that already, which you can also check out using the link in the description below. So anyways, guys, what do you think about AI voice cloning? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Also, if you want to experiment with it yourself, make sure to sign up with Jenny using the link in the description below. Anyways, guys, I'll see you in the next one.